Hello everyone, it's Brandy Janae. Thank you so much for tuning into my channel today. Welcome to another Community Savings Challenge Sunday, including my Battle of the Boxes. So if you're interested in seeing this video, please be sure to stay tuned. Okay, you guys, we're going to start here with, I need to take this out, with this challenge from Donna over at Donna Powered by Creativity. And this is the community savings challenge that she has. And I'm going to be using my $18. So let me make sure this is right. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. Wonderful. Let's get a six-sided die. And this is a one. So we'll put that in there. Number four. Oops. Two. Number four again. Number two. Number one. Number five. Ooh. Number two again. I don't think holidays got anything last time. So, and number one. All right. So, give generously. Got one, two, three, four, five, six dollars today. Holidays, one, two, three, four, five, six. Debt did not get anything today. Self-care got four. Emergency, aka abundance, got two. And nothing in old poop today. All right, and then for my box challenges today, I am going to be playing with um $75 so I'm going to put this back here I do keep all the box challenge money together and then I just use prop money for the actual challenges so I'm looking forward to seeing what that is at the end of the month all right and then this binder is done and I just realized I forgot to read the quote for today oh it looks like it's a scripture excellent Though the mountains be shaken and the hills be removed, yet my unfailing love for you will not be shaken, nor my covenant of peace be removed, says the Lord, who has compassion on you. And that is Isaiah 54 and 10. I love that. So no matter what, God's love for us will not be shaken or removed. And I love that. That's a wonderful reminder. All right, you guys, so in today's Battle of the Boxes, we have the Donut Challenge. This is available in my Etsy shop. And that's in number one. In the number two spot, we have the Mall. And this is by Prop Budgets at the Mall. In the number three spot today, we have the Coffee Binder. And this is from Maria over at She's Got It. And I do have the other components of this binder, but I have not gotten a chance to laminate and um, print and laminate them all. I thought I did only to discover that I did the same thing. <laughs> I printed and laminated the same thing twice. So I'm going to have to go back and do that again. But yes, this is from Maria over at She's Got It. And then this calendar box is from I Will Always Save. And I call it the monthly box. So if you hear me say that, this is the one I'm talking about. But it is called the calendar box. Okay. So again, we have $75. I do have $75 in prop money. So here's $10, $20, $25, $30, $35, $40, $50, $60, $70, $80, $90, $100, $200, $300, $400, $500, $600, $700, $800, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $
59, 60, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 70. Uh oh. How much did I put in there? I feel like I put in 75. Did I put in 70 or 75? Hmm. You guys, I don't remember. Okay, I, I feel like I put in 75. So I'm going to grab another five. And then if I'm wrong, then I will just add another five later. <laughs> I'll find out what I'm editing. But I feel like I put in 75 today. But yeah, if I'm wrong, then I will just add in another five to the binder just to fix it. But I feel like I put in 75. Okay, so we're going to start. We always go through one cycle first. So I have my donut box. Oh, roll and save. So that is uh, this one. Here's the roll and save one. I'm going to use a six sided die for this. Of course, we get a six. Oh my gosh. All right, so we're starting off, <laughs> starting off strong. All right, so 10. Oh, and this is from um, Marty over at Chaos and Budgets. So that is where this cute prop money is. You might, oh, here's another one. <laughs> so you might kind of see it sprinkled in throughout. Oh my goodness, okay. So this card needs to go back in the deck because there's only one of those. All right, so that one is done. Let's go with the mall. All right, let's see which store we're focusing on today. Furniture store. Travel, beauty, candy, clothing, furniture. We have bed for three dollars. And then let's roll to see if we get a, uh, what's it called? A, um, mark out a thing. Oh, an even number. <laughs> okay, so we did not get an even number, but we do need to pull out our, these are the text cards. So, oh, $4. Okay. So we're paying $7 total at the furniture store. And I did put mine in alphabetical order because that's easier for my life. So I'm going to pop this in there. Put a seven. All right. And then I have just been taking these and just putting them in a box. <laughs> and I'm like, I'll get them all sorted out another time. Okay. So I'm going to keep the store cards out in case we get back to this one oops okay uh, all right number three coffee Indonesia This machine is four dollars. What do we have in here already? Okay. So four dollars. Okay, so this is eight. So let's do five, seven, 
eight. Okay, and we'll put those back. Just kind of condensing a little bit as we go. All right. Done with that one. Okay. And our calendar box, last but not least, we have... Uh, is that December probably? Yes, save five dollars. And that one was easy. Mm. All right. Okay, so now that we have made it through one round. I like to do that just so that everything can get touched at least once because I feel like sometimes <laughs> you just keep rolling the same number over and over and over and over again. You do, don't actually get to get to all of them. All right, so okay, calendar box again. We got a four. Oh, that's gonna be September. Eight dollars. I don't know why I'm using such a thick marker. So five, seven, and eight. So we can two, four, five here. And this five and this five can be a 10. That's good. I don't really need any 20s because I don't use as many 10s. But if I do, I can always switch that later. All right. Next box is number three, which is the coffee box. Jamaica. Coffee beans. Oh, this is the last one on this card. Yay. So coffee beans are $2. And I am not ringing the bell for this one until I complete both sides. Because I'm just going to keep this money rolling. So now we're on the scratch off side. But yeah, once I complete both sides of those, then I'll go ahead and ring the bell. Because I recognize that most of these are almost done anyway. Because I've been playing this for a while. Okay, next one. Uh, dealer's choice. We're going to do coffee again. Who we got? Indonesia. Ooh, $10. Sheesh. Five, ten. Mm, mm, mm. Okay. I am going to trade these two fives for a 10, because I might actually need that change later. All right, so there's still one more on this card before we can flip it over. All right, let's roll again. Number one, which is the donut box. Oops. Yum. I went and picked up donuts yesterday from the bakery. So good. Mm, I feel like I roll a six-sided die for this one. All right, this one's only going to cost us a dollar, which is all right with me. So... Two, four, five. All right. Put that back. Put you back. All right. Next one. Oh, dealer's choice. 
Let's do a monthly one this time. A calendar box, sorry. <laughs> oh my gosh. Roll a dice and add ten dollars. Oh goodness. Okay. Oh, nope. Six. I should have kept the three. <laughs> $16. Do I even have that? 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16. Oh my goodness. So 5. You guys, that like took all the money. Um, okay, 10, 15, 16, oh my goodness, and this was 16, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, oh, okay, <laughs> ah, that was a big one, oh my goodness, Sheesh. I don't even know if I have enough for one, roll, one more. Okay, yeah, we can do one more roll, hopefully. Oh, my. Okay. One. Good. The donut box is safe, typically. <laughs> Plinko. Except for it says double the amount saved, so may not be safe after all. All right, do I have a little, um, some kind of little game thing. All right, I'm gonna use my coffee cup. All right, so let's see. We are going to start on the four. Six. Three, four, oh man, <laughs> three, and two. Ah, it's a seven. So we need $14. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So I owe Plinko four dollars. And I trade these ones out for a 10. Oh my goodness. All right, I owe Plinko. Four dollars. Okay. Now, Brandy, where did you put your IOU slips? Ah, here's one. Uh, we'll use the bubble one. These are available in my Etsy shop. Four dollars. So they are laminated so that you can write on them and then erase it just like we do our challenges. Mm, mm, mm. But I like them because it makes you not need the clips anymore. So we're going to just put that up there. Okay, so $4 for this one. And that's it, you guys. I'm out of money. So <laughs> we are done for today. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Also, do not forget to subscribe to my channel if you have not already done so. And hit the notification bell so you can be notified whenever I post a new video. You guys are amazing. Be safe, be kind, or be quiet, and be well. And I'll catch you in the next one.